and to these so you did your morning routine if you haven't watched that video yet go and watch your morning routine video and if you have done it keep on watching I can't believe it's Thursday already let's see what we have to think okay so we have words need of writing um, we have no reading uh, we have social studies um, second class for this week we are going to review rural and urban communities okay so you go to video instruction and then you will work on your sami you're going to click on this worksheet and work on your sami and then you will upload a clear picture of your work for your portfolio okay this is due today all right uh watch this um, before you proceed to work on your sami uh, remember it often helps you to get the right answers if you watch the video and uh, you because we are gonna have a checkup coming up next week okay this is the worksheet you're going to get when you click on that link that you have for social studies what you need to do is you need to print it out if you have a printer and if you don't you can just draw and then color the pictures you have there on this form you would have to draw your own urban and rural community which i think you guys can do very well um and then you just color it uh, so whatever works for you, uh, print out or, or draw your own communities. And then you have to answer the question at the bottom of the page. Um, it's asking if you could choose one of these communities to live in, which one would you choose and why? So you have to say, I don't know, urban, and then say, why would you like to live in urban community? You have to give one, uh, it says two specific reasons, okay? So make sure that you give two specific reasons, not just one. And the same thing, if you say you would like to live in rural community, then again, provide two specific reasons okay and then once you're done you're gonna upload upload this to the portfolio very good okay um then you're gonna have science you will work on this uh, uh inquiry activity prevent erosion that uh, we will demonstrate in our instructional video uh, you will watch it and then that will take you through the pages 54 and 55 so uh, when you start working watching the video make sure that you grab your workbook and you will open it on a page 54 and then uh, you'll be able to complete those two as you're watching the video. Uh, it's a very interesting topic uh, watch it because we will have a project coming up on this so make sure that you know what is a straw bottle what's a breakwater and how that works to prevent erosion uh, then you will complete the science definition worksheet it's the worksheet that we always work on Okay, so this is the worksheet for the independent work on definitions. Um, you have here the word that you have to define. Definition you can find in your workbook. Uh, then you have to write two properties of this structure. Uh, this you will find in a video. So if you listen to the video and watch it, you will be able to find mm -hmm. that in the video. And then you have to write your own sentence. Make sure that you have the straw waddle uh word in the sentence okay and the picture of it don't forget people okay the picture awesome and the same thing you have to do for break water the same thing just like you did for uh straw water the same question uh appear on this one now you can print it out and fill it out or you can just copy it over to a separate piece of paper and upload that to a portfolio today okay okay that is uh all you have to do for science now for math, you have your checkup today. So uh, your mom will get the link in her email. Make sure that you get this done before nine o'clock. Okay, it's on the chapter 15. So if you need to uh, replay the video of a review, um, or if you need to practice your table a bit more, you can do that. Just make sure that you turn this form before 9 p.m. Or if your mommy um, uh, for some reason cannot uh, log you into the Google form, Make sure that she communicates that to me because the form will close at nine okay and then you would have to get an authorization from Ms. nina to open the form okay so make sure that i know what's going on if you can't work on that form and that is all you have for thursday okay um any questions contact me through um dojo or you can write me under the video in the comment section I wish you a blessed day to the. I hope you are um, finishing up your reading project, but that's due on Friday. Just thought to remind you that before I'm going to say bye to you and I will see you in the next video. Blessings to you all.